But first, a problem plaguing many communities is on the rise here in mid-Michigan, and it could be costing you not only money, but potentially life-saving time as well. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I'm Colette Boyd. And I'm David Custer. False alarms and unnecessary 911 calls tying up first responders who could be needed elsewhere and wasting valuable resources. That's right. TV5's Rachel McQuarrie shows us how it's becoming a real issue in Genesee County. Genesee County, 911. Hi, I have um, a belligerent person behind me at McDonald's calling me a I'm going to kick my because I apparently her in line. An uptick in 911 abuse. A caller upset in a local McDonald's drive through after cutting in line and exchanging words with another patron. To this. Tennessee County, 911. Hello? I got a just a couple of the unnecessary calls the Genesee County Dispatch unfortunately has to deal with on a regular basis. Genesee County 911. 911 Dispatcher Krista Poyarena takes over 200 calls a day. She says when people call in during a non-emergency, it could be putting others at risk. You may have an infant that's having trouble breathing. And then this person's calling in because I've had a lady calling because there was snow on her roof. Poyarena says you should only call if you need immediate emergency services like police, medical, or fire. She says another issue they deal with is children getting a hold of old and active phones because 911 can still be used on those. A lot of times they'll call in 20 times in a day and we're like, put your mom on the phone, put your mom on the phone. And the thing with a deactivated cell phone, we can't call it back. So and dispatchers tell us that if you have a non-emergency, don't call 911, call your local police department. In Michigan, it is illegal to misuse the 911 emergency number and people can face charges. Poyarena says it also adds avoidable delays to a already very busy call center. It ties up our phone lines and the trunk lines and it makes it where it's difficult for people, like I said, who do have emergencies to get through. In Genesee County, Rachel McCrary, WNEM TV5. Thank you, Rachel. Now, another option for non-emergency support, dialing 211. It's provided by the United Way, providing op operators that who can actually answer community-related questions.